TFNN Headline News Update Here's Tom O'Brien Welcome folks, we had the Dow Industrials finish up 9, NASDAQ down 12, S&P's off 6. If we get over and take a look at the uh, NASDAQ futures folks, uh, it's going to get really intriguing because we do have uh, Oracle coming out with numbers uh, next few minutes. And what you're going to see coming into the close out here is that uh, they sold this down a bit. Uh, bottom line is that, you know, now these numbers, they, they, they move quick, but we uh, just basically sold down about uh, 20 bucks uh, in a heartbeat. And what you do have is that we went into the lows that were established out here at 10 o'clock this morning, and you have some volume behind the move. So this is going to be pretty wild uh, watching this uh, shake out, because what we will have as these numbers come out, uh, what you will see is that the uh, Oracle... Uh, we'll push these around a little, and then, of course, what you end up happening, depending on uh, whether it's good or bad, uh, there's going to be a lot of other stocks that are going to trade with Oracle, uh, either up or down. Uh, and that will push around those S&P futures. Gold contract, gold contract traded down $13.60 to $12.95. What gold did do, gold got into the strength, when we got into its strength of the... Uh, well, actually, got into his downdraft uh, with light of volume. We did uh, 237,000 contracts out here. Uh, that was going into the, the first downdraft that was out here on March 1st. That had 343,000. Bottom line is that, you know, you didn't get to a swing point. Still wants higher price. If we go take a look at the GDX, you're going to see all the gold equities, silver equities. They pull back with light of volume. GDX, even with throwing uh, the amount into the close, you still came down with 41 million versus 59. Notes and bonds, just they're the ever-ready bunny, folks. Uh, they just continue to want higher prices. It's pretty amazing, actually. Let's go to the TLT, because the TLT, now that had a little volume. So the TLT did have 8, .8 .8 million uh, going into 8 million. Uh, bonds are different, though. And the TLT does trade differently. You know, what, what, I've, what I've noticed, is that when, when I, that's why I just wanted to bring the TLT up right then, is that the TLT definitely trades differently differently than the actual note and bond market. You know, even though that the, the TLT is the 20 year plus ETF, and what 20 year plus means is that the coupon has more than 20 years left in order to basically get paid. Stay right there, folks. We've got lots of numbers coming out after the close. To recap, we had the Dow Industrials up six, NASDAQ down 12, S&P's up seven and a half. Come right back.